Yo, what's up, YouTube? So I was telling Ryan that this customer had their oil changed at Jiffy Lube, and the cu the customer asked April, "Do you think this happened at Jiffy Lube?" And I said, "Well, I don't know. I need to look at your car and find out." So I checked the oil sticker. It was recently done, and any time that I see this shit going on, it's because of the last place that changed the oil. But if if my shop was the last place to, to change the oil, they'd be sending the car on a tow truck, wanting their whole car rebuilt, right? So we tell this customer, why don't you take it back to Jiffy Lube, make them pay for their mistake, and they don't even want to be bothered. But if it was me, Meineke, we'd be getting a third degree. Yep. There's no, there's no other visible damage. This thing is so secured from Honda that it's impossible for it to fall off. And then typically when you see damage to the Ford section here, on the specifically this Honda, like it was damaged, then you could say the customer rode over something and it ripped it apart. Nah, they just never put back in all the fasteners. And then this thing flapping in the air and vibrations, right? And then it just falls apart and then that's what you get. Keep spending your money at Jiffy Lube.